Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Nick Returns here today, back with another video, but as you guys can tell, this video is a Madden video. Shut up, geese! <sighs> Whatever. Well, this is my lineup. As you guys can tell, I'm pretty raw. Just kidding. I'm pretty ass, but yep, let's just get right into the gameplay. Um, I'm a Patriots fan, but I'm playing with the Seahawks uniforms, because the Seahawks uniforms are fucking awesome. And let's just tell you, this first game is so short, just... I, I get off to a rough start, but it's pretty good afterwards, so yeah. So we got we got this play, it's inside zone, we just run it, and then we get about, I don't know how many yards, about about six yards, yeah, that's pretty good, and then I hurry up offense, I don't know why I, I do this sometimes, but I just like to do that, it's sort of what I do, and then I just run a little halfback draw, I literally get nowhere, that's really it, and then next play, here it comes, it's a screen with Deion Lewis, Deion Lewis is the GOAT, and Let's just go right here, you know, that 75-yard juke, juke, oh, no, oh, he didn't juke that, but he's elusive as shit, oh, he's, oh, shit, oh, he's celebrating too early, oh, no, he almost got a fumble, that scared the hell out of me, because I would have been, like, Deshaun Jackson, whatever the fuck his name is in that game, one of the Eagles, <laughs> that was funny, and all, I just want to bring up something, too, this gameplay might be a little bit laggy, because the Elgato is a piece of shit, and so, yeah, let's just get underway here. I don't know what this man was doing. I, I don't understand. He just, it was confusing me. And um, yeah, <laughs> we come up with the big interception right here. You know, then that man leaves the game. He leaves the game. Can you believe that? Then I had to find a new game, play against the Panthers. I don't know about this man's team either. This man's team was ass. Like his own, his number one player on defense was the Darrell Rivas that it was 87 overall that EA gave us. It wasn't that good. Um, but he almost broken out there. But luckily my kicker's D1 and then um, tackled the man. So you know, and getting here is the first play of defense. And but to see what Dante Whitner can do. Hit stick. Ooh, that hit stick. And then just watch what happens next play. Next play, I forgot what I ran. I think I ran bluff three press. But then all of a sudden, you know, I'm just making everybody, like, show blitz or whatever. And then Dante Whitner jumps the fuck out the route. And then TD. So it's f I'm, I have seven points on defense, you know, the first, like, mid of the game. So, yeah, that's pretty good. Get a field goal, make that shit, and then keep the ball again. And then th this man would not return anything after this return. It, it made no sense. I think he was just mad. I don't know. But Navarro Bowman just fucked that man up. He just slung him like a rag doll. So he was coming up. I forgot who this man had in his team, but he was just running. I don't know what this man was doing. He had Ryan Tannehill. And his his receivers cannot catch to save their lives. I don't understand what the hell is wrong with this man's team, but he they cannot do anything at all. I felt kind of bad for the man to be honest with you. It felt kind of embarrassing. Okay, so uh, this man took a while, or a long time to call his plays. It's just and this man. See, that's what I'm talking about. That man can't catch it all. I mean, you hit him in the hands, and it was embarrassing. It was, pre it was pretty funny, though. And then I think he got a first down on this play because um, I put so much pressure on him. And then he just randomly tossed one up to his fullback, and then he caught it. I don't know who the fuck that fullback is, but he's amazing, and he caught that shit. And um, sorry for the laggy footage I already told you. Just look at that black screen. It was disgusting. Oh, here's more black screen. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. And then Dontari Poe. Ah, damn it. He dropped it again. <laughs> man, I feel bad for that, man. Just a little bit, but I did destroy him. you see what find happens a little bit. This gameplay is a little bit long. He almost gets another first down. Oh, I stopped him, though. My run defense is on point. I picked up some new players today. So I got Teddy Bridgewater, 93 overall, and I got that new Adrian Amos, 94 overall, all-rookie team. He has like a 95 speed and he's like pretty raw. I had this gold base version, um, 78 overall, but you know, wasn't that good. This man took forever to call his plays. I, caught, I had tons of footage I had to c 
cut out with this too. And I almost thought he got a first down here. That that would not have been good. But it's like a fourth and one. And I'm thinking that he's gonna like do a fake punt pass or just like not even run a fake punt. Just actually like do like a f like an actual play. But this man tries to do a fake run. And I almost thought he got the first down for a second, but his knee his knee went down like far behind the line of scrimmage. I was so lucky, but you know how we do. I got a Mark Cooper on my team. I got two gloves, Teddy, and I'm about to launch one deep to this man, and he's about to score in like three seconds. Boom, and it trucks the fuck out that man. Look, he just rolled over him like it was nothing. You go, Amari Cooper. That's why. That's why you're raw. That's why you're. That's why you're the best. Like. Receiver in the game. No, hands down, best receiver for a budget squad, by the way. But to get the ball back off. You know, we do. And this is what I'm talking about. This man would not return the ball. He just kept running away from the ball. Oh, that's my, me closing my window. Sorry about this. It was all one take, guys. And I don't know what the hell that man was doing. He was just running down the fast, super, running down the field super fast. I don't understand. Doing those no cuts. No cuts at all. All legit. Okay, I also got a new outro at the end, guys. It's pretty awesome. And I felt bad for this man on this drive because my defense destroyed him. Like, not this play. I don't know what that play was. Ryan Tannehill did not work out for that man. That man quit, like, retired all in one game. And look, I don't understand that. <laughs> I thought it would be uh, for first down, but he ran backwards. Didn't work out for him. And then these next couple plays... After uh, he gets his first down, the next couple plays, this man, I feel bad for him. Okay, we got Merkelis coming off the the left, and we got Matt coming off the right, and so Merkelis just gets a pretty quick sack. You know how it is, only eight yards, a second and eighteen. I run the same blitz, I think, and then you just gonna see what happens next. We got Khalil Mack on the on the left. You know, and then this man runs over there, and oh, it gets sacked for eight yards again. And so right now it's second. I mean, I mean, it's third and twenty-six, with about, you know, like seventy fucking eighty-two yards away from the f whatever. And then he tries to run with Tannehill on third down, and um, that didn't work out for him. And then Marquez picks up the ball, and he's this man's slow. He's pretty fast, but he was running slow. And then no one could catch the man. No one can catch him. You do you. You do you, Michaelis. You're pretty raw. And then we kick the ball back off again. This is when the man kind of gave up. He didn't catch the the ball. And then he just let it go in the end zone. And he left the game. And so this is about the time for the intro to start. I'm going to leave you guys with this man leaving the game. This has been your boy Nick Returns. And peace out.